Understanding Miscarriage, Causes and Diagnosis. Hello, and welcome to our educational video. Today we'll be discussing an important topic which affects many couples around the world, miscarriages, specifically those occurring within the context of intrauterine pregnancy. We'll explore the possible causes of an intrauterine pregnancy miscarriage and how such conditions are typically diagnosed. This topic can be sensitive, and it's essential to approach it with understanding and empathy. We'll be focusing on medical aspects, but it's also important to remember the psychological effects a miscarriage can have. What is an intrauterine pregnancy miscarriage? An intrauterine pregnancy miscarriage refers to the loss of a pregnancy within the first 20 weeks. It's a common occurrence, with studies indicating that approximately 10 to 20 percent of known pregnancies end in miscarriage. However, the actual number could be higher since some miscarriages occur before a woman knows she's pregnant. The loss happens within the uterus, which is why it's termed an intrauterine miscarriage. What are the possible causes of an intrauterine pregnancy miscarriage? There are several potential causes for an intrauterine pregnancy miscarriage, which can range from chromosomal abnormalities to lifestyle factors. Chromosomal abnormalities Most miscarriages, especially in the first trimester, are caused by chromosomal abnormalities. These abnormalities can prevent the fetus from developing properly, leading to a miscarriage. It's worth noting that these genetic problems are usually random and don't tend to repeat in subsequent pregnancies. Maternal health conditions Certain health conditions in the mother, such as uncontrolled diabetes, infections, hormonal issues, thyroid disease, and certain autoimmune disorders, can increase the risk of miscarriage. Anatomical issues and age anomalies in the uterus, such as fibroids or an abnormally shaped uterus, can contribute to pregnancy loss. Also, as women age, particularly after the age of 35, the risk of miscarriage increases due to an increase in egg abnormalities. Lifestyle factors Lifestyle factors such as smoking, heavy caffeine use, drug abuse, and excessive alcohol consumption can increase the likelihood of a miscarriage. How is an intrauterine pregnancy miscarriage diagnosed? Diagnosis of a miscarriage typically involves a combination of physical exams, medical history, and imaging studies. Physical examination and medical history A healthcare provider may start with a physical examination and discuss medical history, focusing on any symptoms that might indicate a miscarriage, such as vaginal bleeding and abdominal pain. Ultrasound Ultrasound is often used to confirm a miscarriage. This imaging technique can show whether the embryo is developing normally within the uterus and whether the heartbeat is present. Blood tests Blood tests can help diagnose a miscarriage by checking levels of human chorionic gonadotropin, HCG, and progesterone. These hormone levels can provide valuable insights into the health of the pregnancy. Miscarriages, while common, can be emotionally difficult experiences. Understanding the causes and diagnostic methods can help couples and individuals better navigate this challenging event. Whether a miscarriage is due to chromosomal abnormalities, maternal health conditions, anatomical issues, age, or lifestyle factors, it's important to remember that medical support and guidance are available. Consult with healthcare providers who can offer personalized advice based on individual circumstances. As we conclude, remember, it's okay to grieve, it's okay to seek help, and it's okay to try again when you are ready.